as an accident of life. I found myself in 2010 becoming CEO of FIRST, an emergency relief organization, and ultimately one whose focus is development in Haiti. Now, nearly six years later, that organization, JPHRO, employs roughly 300 full-time Haitian staff, a number that vacillates relative to funding. We are involved in many sectors including health, engineering, education, housing, and relocation. To varying degrees, we have worked in psychosocial assistance, prevention and education on violence against women, and in the assortment of other needs expressed to us by thousands of Haitian men and women from all walks of life and leadership. And yes, foreign consultants as well. The very concept of aid is, and I believe should be, a constant exploration of societies and self. For foreigners working to supply aid outside of their own countries, not to mention outside of their own homes, or in the mirror itself, it is a constant struggle. It is not the purpose of this piece to supply statistical debate, defense, or criticism. More, it is one practitioner's most current sense of the above-mentioned exploration.